Question and answer. This video is for uh, the individual that was asking about bird stands. Are they a good investment for parrots? Answer to your question, big yes, definitely. So I'm going to go over a few things with you to uh, answer your question and a few other questions about bird stands. Um, in addition to that, a wonderful thing to have for large uh, parrots, or any parrots for that matter, is jungle gyms. There's another video I have on my channel. It's about how to uh, it's not really a how-to, it's just basic information of where I got the materials from and uh, information on how you can get the dimensions to building a jungle gym just like this for your uh, parrot, bird, or macaw. It's a wonderful thing. They love to uh, have things to climb on, things really high to perch on, and it's good exercise for them, especially in the wintertime when you don't have them outdoors a lot. <clears throat> it gives them exercise going up and down, climbing. kind of gives them an individual... Uh, area to claim as their own, definitely a high perching area, it gives them more of a sense of security, etc. Anyway, check out that video and we're going to get on to the bird stands. So this is basically how I take care of my bird stands. It, it simplifies the process of cleaning as far as, uh, now these I haven't cleaned yet this evening, and this is all the excess bird seed uh, from this morning, this afternoon, and from all the other birds that I've had on the stand. I've had about six on them today. So you got your uh, food bowl and your water bowl. I've replaced the wooden post with a uh, PVC pipe. Reason being is they chew through the wood and there's nothing to perch on. So uh, what I do is I get blocks of wood, uh, drill holes in them, run a coat hanger through the wood, hang it on their bird stand or their bird perch and gives them something to chew on because they love to chew on wood. Anyway, so I line the, uh, the bird stand with plastic. Reason being is uh, to make the bird stand last longer. <clears throat> These bird stands are about, uh, you can find them anywhere from, uh, they range from about $40 to $60. And uh, they have wheels on them. As you can see, there is uh, little rolly wheels. They twist and turn, they swivel. Uh, it's definitely some assembly required. There's about six different pieces you have to bolt together. It comes with a hex wrench to put everything together. This is the tray that screws on. Um, the uh, post here actually screws on the top, so you can take it apart in three different pieces if you ever want to take it somewhere with you or uh, uh, store it for any reason. Anyway, so I recommend getting uh, cheap trash bags, uh, you know, one, some of the generic stuff that you can just line the tray with. It makes it easier. You just pick it up one side at a time, dump it in the trash. I, I actually save the leftover bird seed and I throw it in the yard for wild birds. Um, if you overlap the, le the left piece of plastic with the right, anytime they shake or, or the water slops and spills, it'll land on this side and it won't get you know, nasty and gnarly. Another reason why I line the trays with plastic is uh, it keeps them from rusting. There's no way to keep these things from rusting. I've tried everything from Pam to you know, canola oil or things that aren't going to be toxic to them. I mean, it's not like they actually chill on the bottom of the tray anyway, but still, I've tried everything to keep them from rusting. and. They do, and but the good thing is they last for years. This uh, this one bird tray has lasted about four years. It's a really really good investment. Um, anyway, uh, if you do choose to build one of these stands, uh, going by the dimensions on my other video, I recommend you do not connect the PVC directly to the stand. Reason being is, as you can see, it's it shifts, and when they move and jump and bounce and fly from perch to perch and land on it, it's going to shift the entire thing and slop the water everywhere. So you'll be refilling that water all day. Anyway, that's the uh, kind of my review on this thing would be a definite 10. It's a great investment. It's a good way of keeping the majority of your mess on the stand that's easy to, to bag and, and clean. These guys love it. Plus, the good thing about having something high and low is, like I said earlier, they, they got to climb up and down, gives them some exercise if they're ever on their own for a number of hours at a time. Uh, check out my other video about uh, the, uh, the food mixture. Uh, definitely uh, a good thing if you have a bird that's on a diet or anything like that. And anyway, I hope that answered the majority of your questions. Definitely a good investment. Get one and or get two. All right, good luck with your bird.